Welcome to our video about the Fairchild Republic A-10 Thunderbolt II, better known as the Warthog. This aircraft has been a mainstay in the United States Air Force for over 40 years and is known for its ruggedness and versatility in the battlefield. The A-10 was built by Fairchild Republic, a subsidiary of Fairchild Industries, which was later acquired by Lockheed Martin. The first A-10 prototypes flew in 1972, and the first production of A-10s were delivered to the United States Air Force in 1976. The A-10 has undergone several upgrades over the years to improve its capabilities, such as the A-10C upgrade that was introduced in 2005, which included a new avionics suit, a digital cockpit, and the ability to carry precision-guided munitions. The A-10 is a ground attack aircraft designed to support troops on the ground. Its primary weapon is the GAU 8 Avenger 30mm cannon, capable of firing up to 4200 rounds per minute. It also carries a variety of air-to-ground missiles and bombs. The GAU 8 is designed to engage a wide range of targets including armor vehicles, buildings and ground troops. It can also fire armor piercing, incendiary and high explosive rounds. The gun's massive size and weight are balanced by the Warthog's twin engines, which provide enough power to handle the recoil from the gun. The GAU-8 has proven to be an incredible effective weapon in combat, with the ability to destroy armor vehicles and buildings with ease. The Warthog's ability to provide close air support from troops on the ground and its heavy armor, the GAU-8 have made it a valuable asset in the battle. The A-10's design is optimized for low-speed, low-altitude operations. Its twin engines provide excellent power and maneuverability, and its straight wings allows for a large weapons payload and low speed stability. The aircraft is also heavily armored to protect the pilot and critical systems. The A-10 has been used in numerous conflicts including Operation Desert Storm in the 1990s where it played a crucial role in the coalition's success by providing close air support for ground troops. The Warthog 30mm cannon and its ability to carry a variety of air-to-ground missiles and bombs made it especially effective against Iraqi armor and artillery. It also played a vital role in the operation Iraqi Freedom in 2003, where it was used in both ground attack and reconnaissance role. The A-10's ability to low tier for extended periods of time and its ability to cooperate in low altitudes, low visibility environment made it an ideal choice for identifying and engaging enemy targets. In more recent conflicts, such as Operation Enduring Freedom in Afghanistan, the Warthog has been used to support special forces and conduct airstrikes against Taliban and Al-Qaeda targets. The A-10's ability to fly at low altitudes and its heavy armor make it well suited for flying in the mountainous terrain of Afghanistan. The A-10 has also been deployed to various other theaters such as Kosovo, Somalia, and most recently in the operation Inherent Resolve against ISIS in Syria and Iraq. The Warthog has a long history of proving its worth in the battlefield. With its ability to provide close air support for troops on the ground, its heavy armament and its ruggedness make it an invaluable asset for the United States Air Force and its allies. Thank you for watching this video about the A-10 Warthog. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and subscribe for more content like this.